Afternoon, bitches. Lindsay from Rooster Teeth here, and I'm bringing you the first recap of April. Spring has sprung, and so have I. What does that mean? I don't know. But you should. If springing continues for more than 20 minutes, you should probably consult a doctor or a prostitute. Your choice. This past Monday, RT finally turned 10 years old. Moving on up from the diapers and into the training pants. Thank you guys so much for all the memories. You are the best fans we could ever ask for. And although I was only here for two years, they were pretty sweet. I know we had that thing and then you didn't call me back that one time, but it's okay, I moved past it. I don't wash your house anymore. And in honor of those sweet 10 years, we've released a brand new short. It's the RT Shorts reunion. The boys are back, baby! Featuring Bernie, Gus, Joel, Matt, Oh, what was that other asshole? Oh, Jeff. Just kidding, Jeff. Please let me continue working at Achievement Hunter. <sighs> and in yet more honor of those honorable 10 years of honor, we're doing a sale in the store. You can get 10% off your purchase if you enter code RT10YEARS. And the sale ends this coming Wednesday, so hurry the fuck up and buy some shit, okay? Say it. <laughs> I was just asked to say that we're on an honor roll. What might one buy with that 10% off? We have the 10 year anniversary t-shirt. It's sleek, it's stylish, and you can rub it in your friends' faces that you've been a fan this long and they haven't. Your friends kind of suck. I really question your judgment and who you hang out with. And we have the Bernie bobblehead featuring yours and my favorite cast member, Mr. Bernie Burns, the B-man himself. It's from the animated adventure where he goes to Bernie Tasmania and decides that uh, he should have that town. It's his, really, by birthright. I agree, I agree, Bernie, I know. I just got that like tossed in my chest so hard. Get the official Griff Ball. Normally it's a con exclusive, but we're putting it in the store for you guys. It's only there for a limited time though, so they will run out. Get yours and you can squish with me. They're so soft. And we have a super wide array of slap bands to go with the sweet Achievement Hunter and Rooster Teeth ones that I know you have. We have the Cakeless slap band and the Let's Play slap band. And we have the Tower Pimp slap band and the Yellow slap band. So not only can you feel like a badass, but you can ruin your life because you know, you only have one. Might as well fuck it up like my grandma used to tell me. And for all you ultra animated adventure fans, we have the animated adventure faces slap band as well as Joel's pet snake. You know, the one that pooped in the pool and freaked everybody out. But this one won't poop on your wrist or freak you out. Ugh. And of course we have the red versus blue logo slap band as well as the project freelancer slap band. Eh, eh, eh. How meta. I feel like I'm going to a rave or something. Why are you waving that glow stick in my face? Please stop. And we have some sweet new DVDs for you guys. We have the best of Red vs. Blue, the best of Animated Adventures, and the best of shorts. Bernie, you had your turn! Each of these come individually, or you can buy them all together in a bundle pack. It's like a sweet Triforce of fun, and like, this is the Kokiri Emerald, and this is totally like the Zora Sapphire, and this is like the Koran Ruby, and they're gonna form together in the Temple of Time, and you're gonna save Hyrule, and get laid. And we have the ruby pin set that we sold at PAX East. Now, I know you guys don't know what all these symbols mean, but they will be explained to you and you will freak out. You guys have probably seen it already, but in case you haven't, check out the ruby black trailer featuring Blake Belladonna. Ooh, she's a saucy minx. If you want to see the premiere of ruby and other awesome badass shit, come to RTX. It's this July 5th through the 7th. If you haven't gotten your tickets already, click right here. You can get hotel discounts too. In this week's RTAA, hashtag Dan the man has trouble ordering food. It's okay, mouth words are hard sometimes. And he didn't understand the menus are vertical columns, so he just read straight across. He goes, <laughs> I want a Big Mac Chicken Legend Sunday. <laughs> menus, how do they work? On this week's podcast number 212, the boys are coming at you from Atlanta, Georgia, on the set of the newest episode of The Walking Dead, I mean Immersion. Is this extra? Man, the twisted one? motion, huh? I'm, I'm not into that. All right, just, there we go. <laughs> there we go. The, the old Indian burn. And in this week's RT Life, Gus and Kara finish bottling the brand new RT beer, available in the store, uh, never, because it smells like shit. Joel, are you excited for Rooster Teeth beer? You're awesome, thank you. I'm excited to see how people are gonna get poisoned. Speaking of 10 year olds, it's time for Achievement Hunter. We have three Let's Plays for you guys. Monopoly Part 1, New Super Mario Brothers U Part Deuce, and Minecraft Episode 45, Tread the Needle. And in a brand new versus, Jack goes head to head with Ray. Ray, you're gonna get literally eaten. This week on Awu, we got Episode 157. Jeff, Jack, and Ray decide to host while Gavin and Michael are away, probably making out touching butts and stuff. I just can't compete with all that hair everywhere. This week's horse is Jack versus Jeff. It's the boss man versus the beard man. I think if Jack wins, he's gonna get fired. Jeff's a sore loser. Dude, you haven't heard about the other three Jacks that used to work here. They're dead. On this week's Things to Do In, the guys play Chicken Bucket in Minecraft. They kind of know the Colonel on like a first name basis. I'm sorry, Mr. Sanders. If you're listening, I love your products. I appreciate all that you do for me. 
and my taste buds. On this week's Rage Quit, Michael gets frustrated with a game, then ignores it, breaks it, and leaves it alone for a while. Kind of like Gavin's heart. Such a dramatic episode. As the cock bites. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, we have Fails of the Week, number 133. I don't know why you guys keep failing. Can we succeed for once? Loser! You're a loser! All right, guys, that's it for me this week. I gotta go enjoy this wonderful weather before it leaves. 